So this game, Hell Screen, is described as um, HR Geiger meets Doom with a rear view mirror uh, in the top of your UI. Yeah, this is the one you tagged me in, and I and I they gave me a key. So uh, uh, every 30 minutes, you will be getting a, uh, a message in chat from Zilk letting you know where you can get the game. Um, I would appreciate retweets on this tweet so that people know because this game looks really cool and I like supporting indie devs. And this is the first time an indie dev has ever given me a key. So I would really like to um, I would really like to, you know, make it like make it good for them. So. We're gonna go ahead and get Hellscreen launched. We're gonna play it. We're gonna have a good time. Hellscreen and yeah, let's wash our mouths out from Devolver with Hellscreen. It's very exciting. Like I said, it is the first time that any developer has ever given me this. So. Um, yeah, this is a work in progress. Uh, so if you want to play this demo yourself, by the way, for any reason, um, if you would like to play your, your, or this demo yourself, it will be on Steam's Next Fest um, on the 13th, which is just a few days from now on Monday next week. Um, Steam will be hosting their Next Fest, which is a thing where you can usually play the demos of, sorry, you can usually play the demos of indie games that are coming out. Um, and the whole point is to like kind of get you hyped about games that are like about to come out or you know coming out soon, usually indie games. Um, this demo, I have early access to it, but it will be available for everybody to play on Monday. Yeah, Maddie, this is the one I told you to be here for. Uh, sorry that it took so long. I forgot the summer's game or summer game fest was today, Maddie. Sorry. Um, so yeah. Uh, uh, can I make the bot do it now? I don't know. I'm just going to copy exactly what the bot says. Here you go. <clears throat> there you go. That is the all the links for Hellscreen. Uh, so please go ahead and give it a look. Let him know I sent you. Obviously. Um. Wait. Okay. There we go. Uh, let me turn down the mouse sensitivity. Ever so slightly. Um. Let's turn up the music and the sound effects. Fuck it. Oh, okay. That's very strange. Let me put that back up. Can I... There we go. That's basically perfect. Alright. So, as you can see, I've got a rear view mirror. Um, and I am in hell. Ooh. Ooh, I like that noise when you jump. If you guys have any feedback, by the way, let me know. Uh, the devs specifically asked for me to give feedback to them. They might even show up in chat. I have no idea. Um, but uh, they, uh, if you guys have any feedback, like you think like, oh, this doesn't look good, or this part doesn't look good or whatever, or this part looks really good, let me know. I want to tell the dev everything that they need to know because I'm basically playtesting it for them. So uh, please let me know if you guys have anything you want to say. Left shift to open or close mirror. Oh, oh, you can make it like half your screen. Oh, that's trippy. Oh, that's fucking trippy. Okay. Space to jump. Left control to crouch. Oh God, you move real fast. Ooh. Ooh, your gun's right in the center. Oh, I like it, I like it. Wait, I have like a speedometer. Look, when I move the, the white line like fills up. I'm liking the music. Wait, hold on. I'm gonna turn on Reva Tuner statistics just so I can limit this to 60 FPS so that we don't have any potential weird issues. Dev, dev appears to be in the UK. Oh, you know what? That's a good point. I, did think of, I didn't think about how late I was streaming this. That's fine. All right. How do I? Oh, you have to shoot the door. Okay. <gasps> moving forward. That's why you have the white bar. Moving forward does two times damage. Always be moving. Oh, I like that. Oh, I like that. Find soul cores to unlock something. Pick up a soul core. Press tap. Oh. What is this? 
Oh, these are maps, I think. Oh, God. I didn't mean to go into the map, but okay. Can I, can I, nope, I can't go back. Okay. I feel like I fucked up by going to the fourth level by accident. Okay, wait. Oh, I can I can go back. Okay. I, I just have to press tab and I can go back it seems like. Okay. Okay. Uh all right. I don't I don't understand what any of this stuff is. I'll be honest. Wait, I press tab and it doesn't work now? I'm very confused. Hold on, you know what? Kill me. Kill me so I can reset because I don't know what's going on. Kill me. Do I touch you to die? Do I have to wait for you to attack? Okay. Well, there we go. Oh, that is, that is quite a death screen. Oh. Oh, okay. I don't get to go back. Never mind. God, you hold right click to shoot behind you. You hold right click to shoot behind you. Or you press right click, I guess, not hold it. You have to shoot in your rear view. Wait, is that what, what's up with these guys? Do I have to? Oh, they don't die if I shoot them from the front, I think. They don't die if I shoot them from the front, I think. Oh? What is this? Oh! Yeah, they don't die if I'm shooting them from the front! Cause look! Oh no, they do! Eventually, it looks like. But it takes a lot longer? Whereas if I'm shooting it from behind... Oh god, I died. Oh, there's a gun! Shotgun, two to select. Oh, that's a mini shotgun! Oh, yeah! Oh, that's fucking meaty! than they appear. Hold on, let me turn it down a little. Maybe I should have left it where it was. I'm leaving the music where it was, though. Or back at one. Huh? Oh! Wait, look, they're invisible! They're invisible from the front! problem that I'm having now is that the controls are technically inverted in the mirror, which makes sense. I think there's a way to change that? No, there wasn't. Okay. viscera when you kill them okay okay all right picked up a soul core i don't i still don't know what i'm doing is my only problem with this part so that's my pistol i don't know where i'm going I don't totally understand these soul cores or what they do. I will say that. 
Wait. Maybe this is the only one I could go into, because I can't go. Oh, wait. Nope. I can go into them. Ah, oh, jeez. Oh, wait. This is the tutorial. Huh? I'm confused. Wait, is this a secret? No, it's not. Okay. Okay, maybe that's something to mention to the dev. I'm a little confused by uh, the menu so far, like the, the level select. <clears throat> Try to find other cores. Oh, I think the things above are telling me whether or not I found them, because like I found that one and that one maybe. And I need, oh. Oh, I think it's saying how many I need to go into these. So I started here then here, and now I have two, so I can go in here. I think that's the way it works. Okay, okay, never mind. That's not as confusing as I thought. I think it still might could use a little explanation, but otherwise it seems fine. so cool. The, the fact that I keep having to look up and like some enemies can only be killed from behind like that is really interesting. That's so good. That's so good. Oh my god. I love this. Like it's a little gimmicky or not gimmicky. That's not the right word. It's a little like janky I guess because the controls are inverted and it's a little hard to get used to. But like, I just love the experimentation, you know? And also, yes, the shotgun sound is extreme cum. Okay, this is so the, so it's somewhere. Yeah, it shows you stuff sometimes. Oh shit, I didn't mean to press that. How do I, I can't make it go away. Ah, I can't make it go away. Oh, okay, there we go. It just got bugged for a second. Cool. If it, it, yeah, it does level previews. It, yeah, it does. Yeah, this is why I love indie games. Like, this shit is inventive as hell. Can I? Oh, fuck. Oh, wait. Oh, that's a bug. Oh, that's a bug. Okay, let's, uh, let's reset that. That was a bug. I'm not sure how I get across otherwise, though. Wait. No, it's nothing like that. That's a shame. Okay. And I love that it's always encouraging you to move fast. Move fast, eat ass. That's what this game said. I also love that using the rear view, like, big, like, uh, hide your fucking screen. change I would say to this is to make it so that it's not inverted controls in the mirror. If that's like even possible. I guess I don't know if it is. Okay, well I have all the soul shards now that spawns that. not sure how to get over there without jumping. 
How would you do that though? Well, it's easy. You make it so that your, uh, or you make it so that the, uh, the view up, you can either flip the view up here. So it's like, you know, like, like, how do I phrase this? Okay, wait, hold on. So see how in the view up there, the, the stairs are to my right or to my uh, left rather. Um, you just make it so that the view up there is flipped so that it's, it's like mirroring that perfectly. Or you just have it so if you hit shift, uh, you know, to bring the mirror up, then it, 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 it like inverts your control so that it's not inverted in the mirror. Cause like if my, like if, if I go in here and I do this, right? And I press this, then this feels normal, right? This feels normal. So just make it, make it so that your, whenever you press this, like your controls are not mirrored or your controls are inverted or whatever. missing something for the thing to show up. Because otherwise I'm not sure how to get through here. I'm not sure how to get through here without jumping and that is bugged and won't kill me. Or at least it didn't before. I'm not quite sure. I'm not even sure if you can. But I might just be missing something. missing? No, it wasn't. Hmm. Well, that's what I'm saying, Maddie. Make it so that, like, like this is not inverted. Like, like how it is right now, this isn't inverted. But if I do this, if I make it big, then it inverts. I mean, maybe. I don't know. That's just me. Oh, it was back here. I would, I'm dumb. I didn't, I thought it was over here in this other part of the level. I had to go to the start again. I thought it was over here. I could have sworn it was, there, I mean, there is a core right there. I don't know. Oh well, I have three now, so this one's open. I mean, it also just seems like a skill thing. Like I could just, you know, they are part of the system and the system must die. Hell yeah, I can pick up. I can pick up what you're putting down. Is that though? Wait, did I already do this level? Cause yeah, this is where I got the shotgun. I might have just went to the same level by accident. Oh, God. 
trying to kill me. gotten this one, so I definitely just went back and did the same level by accident. Um, well, wait. Wait, did it? Oh, Z to walk slowly? Oh. Okay, that was my fault. Find a way to break the red glass. Many are saying this. Oh, wait, maybe that'll let me go back and break the red glass in the other level. You know, I'm picking up the ethos of this game. It wants you to never stop holding forward, which means you have to just run past stuff and shoot it behind you in your rear view mirror. That's fucking cool. Like you never should be strafing backwards like this. You should be always moving forward. No matter what, always move forward. So this is a small glitch that I keep noticing where um God damn it. Uh, I keep I noticed a small glitch where it keeps not letting me like make my thing bigger or smaller, like look in my rear view. Um it keeps like not letting me do that. Depending on like like if it shows me something, sometimes it bugs out and doesn't let me anymore. So am I controls inverted? No, we're good. Oh, you have a double jump! Wait, no you don't. Okay, never mind. God, this is such an inventive concept for a game. I'm genuinely in awe at how inventive this is. Its art style is immaculate. Ooh, you can go above uh, 100 health if you just pick up the right stuff. Fuck. Am I gonna die? No, I'm not. Okay, you might want to put uh, kill screens here. Just in case. Um, it is not taking me into the level, which is not good. Okay, there we go. Shooting behind you does quad damage when moving forward. Oh my god. Are you fucking kidding me? Holy shit. just always be shooting behind you then. Oh no. Fuck me. I wasn't paying attention to where I was. Um, I am sideways. What? Uh, hmm. Uh, okay. So this is persisting, huh? Um, all right, hold on, let me just, uh, just restart it real fast. Hopefully it saves my progress. If not, that's fine too. It's a little buggy. It's okay. It's all right. It's a demo of a, uh, but not even a release demo yet. I'm playing the pre-release. That happens. That happens. I'm fine with that.
Okay, yeah, it says continue, so it saved my progress. That's nice. I gotta get out of the tutorial again, but that takes like two seconds. Forward does two times damage. Find soul cores to unlock new maps. Okay. There we go. Alright, let's try this one again. There are hidden cores in every level except the tutorial. Yeah, there sure are. I saw one of them behind the thing. myself in front of it if I know I can. That's a shame. break the red glass. Shotgun sounds so much. It's just so good. It has it's better than it has any right to be. Huh? Where's this sending me? You got 25 more shells in this four round shotgun. That's what I'm saying. My shotgun has so many rounds in it. Your rear view flashes when stuff's about to get uh, about to hit you from behind. Or does it does it flash? Hmm. 
I don't know what makes it flash, actually. Oh. I just flash when, whenever you can hit an enemy. I'm not sure. What a nice, big, expansive, open level. I think this might be a texture glitch. Well, I'll have to ask. Absolutely gonna. Are you telling me you're not? It's the double barrel shotgun. They are the same sounds. This is true. I kind of hoped it would be a meteor sound. I gotta figure out where the E, bu the e button is. You think it's right there on my keyboard, but it's really not. Which is the fucked up part. Oh, I have it now. Aha! myself quite that much. I hate myself, but not quite that much. Maltron? I'll admit, I don't even know what that one is. Could have made that up. Thanatos be nice to yourself challenge failed instantly. Oh man, this really sends you up high. Well, there's one. No, there's there's definitely more here. I want more. There's more to explore here. I should have just shot him from behind using my that thing. I'll find a way to demonstrate kindness to you. This is a threat. No, true, don't do it.
There's more here. I know there is. I just got to find it. No, 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 no. Ooh, that was close. Aha! Here's the other door. Oh, wait. This just leads back to over here. Fuck. Wait, what about up here? Aha! See one down there. There's a soul shard here. Scouting around is uh, for secrets is maybe a little bit antithetical to the idea of speed, but also it's you know clearly based on Doom, and I like Doom, uh, and you know secret hunting in that is it's sometimes fun more so in the originals than in the remake. Yeah, that's also true. Speed only does only matters in uh, combat. This is a true fact. There's only one more soul shard. Where is it? Oh, it's up there. Oh, oh, I see. What the hell? Oh, that was almost really bad. I almost fell into the infinite void. Yeah! Wait, what? There's still one more. Shit. Where could the last one be? Okay, no, that's not. Hmm. Is it back behind here? There's stuff over here because there's stuff I haven't killed. Aha! You've led me to your downfall, fools! Oh gosh. Wait. demo. There's a lot to explore in it. Uh, now where was the... Where was it? Was it over here? Yeah, it was. There it is. Got the soul core. them all on every level. I don't know. That's the tutorial. There probably is another one in there. Definitely got them all in there. I don't think I got them all in there. I'm gonna 
check in here. Fabuki 4K, thanks for the follow. Welcome to the graveyard. I hope you enjoy your stay. I have like lost and gained a bunch of like I started at 1420, then I went down to 1419, gained a follower, lost one a day again, it went down to 1419. And now I'm at a uh, 1419 or went down to 1418. Now I'm at 1419 again. I don't totally know what's going on. Okay, well that's both of the cores in there. I don't think I got the extra one in here. I know one of the thing the people that followed me was just a bot though, so. Uh, the other one, I know for a fact, I know where it is. It's right here. Maybe something happens if we get all the cores in the level. Okay, well, I have two from there, two. Oh shit. Wait, no. Ah, son of a bitch. Just gonna grab all these soul shards. You will watch the gotcha ad, and you will uh, see the game that Kyrie Thanatos can't get the fucking zombie girl she wants to get as penance. You will. You will. Alright, last level. The only way is up. Oh, that's very pretty. I like this audio of like bl r blood rain that seems to have been recorded in like a shower. Like just like somebody's shower running. That sounds like a joke or like I'm being glib or whatever. I unironically like it. It's funny. That's cool. Neat little hidden spot. hidden stuff. Maybe over here? Yeah, it looks like it. in here that's so cool actually because it's like pitch black you can see in there with your rear view i know it's so meaty right babe it's so fucking meaty oh wait yeah i wanted to play that shotgun sound hold on let me hear this oh how they use shotguns in movies this guy yeah I've seen this before. Oh my God, that is the exact same sound. You're right.
I'm gonna be honest, I would play the full game of this. I would 100% play the full game of this. This is fucking cool. Like, even the bugs or whatever have not, like, the little bugs of, like, falling through the world and it not killing you or whatever have not deterred me or made me be like, uh, it could use some work. Like, it, it, obviously it could, in the sense that anything could use some work. But this is just good. I'm just having a good time. I feel like this is supposed to do something. Uh, oh my god. when I kill him. Holy shit. All right, well, that was health screen. Um, my bot never went off for some reason. I don't know why, I'm really annoyed about it because uh, I set it up so that it would, but whatever. Um, again, you can find that here. Uh, that's the developer's Twitter, the health screen Twitter. Um, and the Steam page for it, you can find it there. Just put it in chat. Um, this fucking ruled. This was incredible. Like, first of all, I want to thank the dev, UK Resistant, for giving me a uh, key to this and letting me play it early. You can find this, uh, you can find this yourself and go find the chords that I missed. Uh, you can find this next week. I'm turning it down a little bit so I can talk. Uh, you can find this next week on Steam's uh, Next Fest. Again, um, you can... I'm not sponsored or anything. I'm just trying to get the word out because I appreciate Indie Dead. They didn't, like, pay me or anything. They just gave me the key. But, um... I don't think that counts as sponsorship, especially since the demo will be free. This is just the demo. Um, but, yeah, uh, you should you should go, like, get the demo of this and play it. Um, it was fucking cool. You can go find the missing stuff that I found. There might even be some kind of secret ending if you do i don't know music was cool sound was cool everything was cool i liked this a lot um and yeah you can play it next week so that is that so sofa king cool sofa king cool indeed that sofa king he's just he's a rap scallion with how cool he is anyway um Um, sorry, I'm just trying to see here. What we feel like doing. Love seat Lord Awesome. Oh, I'm sorry, puppy doll. That's annoying. Um, I think I'm gonna end the stream here. I didn't have that much more planned. Um, I wanted to do uh, this and I wanted to do um... Oh, she just ended. Uh, I wanted to do this and I wanted to do um... What's the word? Uh, uh, hell scream or hell screen. I wanted to do this and I wanted to do summer game fest. So that's about all I've got for you today. I'm going to get you guys over to Bebu, who is hosting Dungeons & Dragons with Lily. Um, I know Lily is there, I think. I'm not sure who else is. My, I might even be wrong about Lily. But Bebu's streaming, so I'm going to get you guys over there. Uh, goodbye, everybody. Thanks for being here. I will see you tomorrow. Bye! Boo! <laughs> Did I scare you? Thank you for watching. 
and especially a big thank you to everybody in today's credits for their support on the stream. I hope to see you again soon. Bye!